news? I don't know. I hope they all take a long walk off a fucking short pier at this point. Like, you gonna be fucking stupid? Be fucking stupid the fuck out of my place. That's the reason I started fucking going private before I went live, because this shit is stupid. Stupid. Viciously violent with uh, Speaking people. of shit, right. I viciously. I got a tag back. You gonna have to send me an email. It won't send uh on text message. Uh yeah, man. no, I I said that word right before I hit the end button. I didn't get the end. I was restricted because of I don't know, probably calling you a rug person. That's probably the reason I actually got muted, but whatever, it don't fucking matter, dude. I'm just so fucking sick and tired of people acting like they're better than somebody else. Or how did I miss that? Trying to discredit their sobriety just because you don't fucking like nobody or somebody. That's fucked up. It really is. I got people sending me fucking lots and shit telling me somebody that I don't even speak to that has no fucking idea about me calling me a d an oak. Head. Yes. I ain't never touched that shit a day in my goddamn life. Last night they can't like, in my face and I don't think I can do it. Fucking so stupid. <laughs> but whatever. I'm gonna sit here being me. Passing every test. I done told y'all, order me one. Order me a test and I'll pee on it for you on camera. I'm not gonna go buy that shit because I already have to pay for enough of them. Um, so, how about it, boo-boo? Really? Yeah, I know. I am feral. I'm like, really ashy. It's only one day of being cold. Who dropped out the box? Oh, Squishy dropped out the box. I was like, where's Squishy at? Stewie's in there, too. Yeah, I'm just killing time to my husband. Hold on, where are they and then the baby comes home, and I guess you've been married again. 19 years. Men 20 come. Uh, August 31st, next year. Oh, well, we're going to, oh. yeah, we're, well, we've been planning it because we didn't get to, like, get married somewhere. It was just me and him. Um... At a chapel, at a chapel, and um, oh god, what's that city out there by you? Um, uh, well, not by you. Uh, uh, I'm still leaving the, this house in flip flops. I wish we're oh, I'm sorry, we listening to Chrissy. Well, Chrissy, A Hood, and I don't know Mindy. I don't think I do. I've seen her, but I don't know her like that. But so yeah, we're just we're just listening. Yeah, she's okay. Uh, we're going to um, Vegas next year. We already reserved the Airbnb. Yeah. She doesn't said. She said, "Tell me when you go live. I'll tell all of them. I know she's listening to me in the background." <laughs> Flip flops when it snows. Okay. <laughs> I fucking love it. I. Well, the, okay, and the venue, now I have seven there. I, I don't know. I'm weird there. about flip flops nowadays um, just because I don't but, really like flip flops. Dylan's mom's but, gonna do um, the, my cake. Yeah. But the venue uh, oh, shit. will take 50 people. Hold on, I gotta ask him if he needs me to. Hold on. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm a crock lady unless it's raining. Hey, baby. Baby. Do you, are we taking the jacket tonight to the one or no? And what time? Hold on. I have you y'all for just a second.
It's bright as fuck out there. Brighter than my whole life. Yeah. It's on probation. Yeah. I mean, it's a, it's a great day. I don't think it's gonna... You know, people yeah. don't realize it's bright comes in stages. So, yeah. even as you do turn around and get further out, nope, it's long. still a different Bucks. stage. You know, I think every yeah. year it's a different stage. Absolutely. You know, so... If you don't actually have, have fucking... enough strength in your body to fight it, then oh, well. to... you'll come to your circumstance. Yeah, he's yeah. doing really well. I mean, he has he had a sponsor. He's working the steps, going to meetings. Um, once he's legally off of probation, he'll be able to. He's gonna go work at the rehab that he went to as a as a residential RA. So that'll be good. Yeah. It's My god brother did that. Um he actually tried to well he succeeded almost. What are you talking about? I'm sorry. What are you? What chick, honey? The YouTuber? I'm sorry. I couldn't figure out what this is. I y'all, y'all gotta be a little bit more specific on your messages because I don't get like there's too many players in this fucking game. Like you can't say Kim and me just know who you're talking about. There's fucking twelve Kims. Watch out. Move, bitch, get out the way, get out the way, bitch, get out the way. Oh, I'm sorry, y'all, I'm trying my fucking best. I'm about to just post this fucking video and say, fuck it. Oh, should I give y'all a sneak peek before I post it? No, my videos or my lives just gonna get recorded. So, I mean, he's better now. Go big or go home, right? No, so just so my people know, and I know there's a hell of a lot more than just my people in here, but someone posted a video like calling me a liar that oh i had proof that you helped lisa since may and blah, blah, blah. i'm gonna use your own words like i how many times show of hands in the in the comment section like can you believe she spent her birthday talking about me for hours y'all hours i bet i do but <laughs> nope. Anyway, um, but how many of y'all remember that I told y'all, like, I'm sorry, I know I lied, I was trying my best to convince everybody that it wasn't me running the app because I didn't want to run the app, I tried to put it in her name, it wouldn't go in her name, so I ended up having to run it myself, right? Look how they did. No? Anybody? All them prisoners in the jail. Did they really? Yeah, same thing with yeah, same thing with Louisiana when Katrina hit. Um, they lost a exactly. Lot of it's insane. Um, but just like these people can be like every time when Lisa opens her mouth, she's lying. They had a but when she says I took money from her or. Either one of the cams or fuck anybody for that matter stole money yeah, from her. Very, very All of a sudden, she's not lying. But her mouth is open. I thought when her mouth was open, she was lying. I, that's what I thought. I mean, I understand they're there for a reason. No, you didn't have to run it. I did run it, though. I've already said that. Or the worst of the worst, you know? Right. I know I did. That's not what I was meaning by what I said. That's not what I was meaning. So, I was meaning that I ran it because she couldn't get logged into it. 
That's what I meant. Like, I had to run it. Not that I, like, it was, I had to. I, I don't know why um, that makes sense to me and not you, but that's okay. But again, I know I didn't have to do shit. I'm meaning, like, I had to, get, I tried to get her signed into it, and I didn't. I got that end of the house cleaned up. That's what I was wanting you to come out there and look at. Oh, I, I didn't know you wanted me to come out there, baby. Me waving you over and pointing at the house. <laughs> should have told you, hey, come on. I was getting this. the stuff out of the dry, dryer so that I could switch it? clothes over. What? Where'd you put it? Where'd I put what? So you the clothes? Got the stuff out of the no, I cleaned up the, I was cleaning up the floor. Okay, whatever. But no, I didn't have to. Exactly. I didn't have to, but I did. I did get involved. I did help. That was stupid, absolutely. But everybody, well, not everybody, two particular people keep on telling people that I ran cash apps since May. No, I didn't. Yeah, I was sweeping and getting it all cleaned up right there, babe. I'm not like you. Anyway, but yeah, so I I have a video I'm about to post that shows step by step what I've already said. I am gonna also upload it to YouTube because <laughs> we know how TikTok be sometimes. Yeah. I felt sorry for her. I really did. Uh, and again, I don't think, I think everybody is like not remembering the first part of that. When I sent, before the $30, I had sent her a little bit, but not much. Like, you know, $3.51, I think is what it was. And, but the day that I sent that 30 at the beginning of July, someone was literally laughing on a live, which I have since talked to, so I'm not going to say names. If you know, you know, but don't say it in my chat, please. Girls, if you see it, please mute for five seconds if they keep it up. Do it again. Um, or you know what to do. Anyway, but the morning of, and it even says them in my text messages, the day I sent the 30, Lisa, or there was somebody, well, a group of somebodies, on a live, um talking shit um and somebody i guess didn't know where the kid's father was and they said well why did the kid kid not go to his dad he went to the grandparents and uh, like they were asking basically if he was an addict too and somebody said he audited mm-hmm and this woman legitimately laughed and said the same thing that's going to happen to his mom. I don't care. If you want to make that statement, fucking make it. But don't laugh about it because nothing about that's fucking funny. What is my YouTube? It's on, it's on my thing. I don't have it up on YouTube yet. You go back. We need to, please, tonight because you work the weekend. I, we need to get that somewhere where I can check to see if we're keeping it or not keeping it. Um, and as far as... What would that be? Living. Um, and as far as the, uh, the blankets, did you, you didn't put anything in the washer yet, right? Okay. What time is it? Oh, it's already two. Excuse me, so I can sink past you. You're good. You're good. But I felt bad for her. She was on there. She was crying, saying she needed food, and she needed this, and she needed that. I sent her $30. That was July 6th or 7th. Not sure. And um, I was saying, no clue what. Oh, I'm sorry. My, no. Babe, I don't, all I have is baby blankies. Well, I have one of sissies. I have Emma's. I'll stop in one more. Yeah. Well, since we're going to get the, um, the other hoodie, then we can just do that. Anyway, so, when, oh shit, I was going to grab my fucking, whatever it's called. Uh, so yes, I felt bad. I was working on emotion. 
Y'all, I was super, like I've done said that, I'm early in my sobriety with this and everything. Like, I don't know. I truly, truly, truly felt like if I could get close to her, if I could gain her trust, hopefully she would start listening to me. And I said that, and everybody, like literally the same people that are like, well, this is why Kim did it. I said that too, like before Kim said it. And I'm not saying Kim copied me. I'm just saying I didn't copy Kim. Um, like I just, what? Thank you. I really do. Like, obviously, it was not a very good decision. My YouTube link should be in my bio, but I've, it's Victoria No Secret something. I think it's Victoria No Secret 86, or it could just be Victoria No Secret. I'm not sure. I'll look in just a second. What? I don't know what I'm doing. Walking around in fucking circles, I guess. Oh, right here. I'm sorry. I know. I'm making somebody nauseous. Y'all are dizzy. I'm sorry is what y'all say. But I, I just, I don't know. Believe me, my husband was mad, uh, upset, not mad, upset about it, that I was helping her. He was tired of hearing about it. I know you still are, baby. Not what I was meaning. Um, everything. But, so, just the one part to that video, like I, like I said, I do kind of break it down all the way. I just look away. I know, nobody else seemed to be able to do that. But... Just really quick so that y'all can see this. Um, okay, like I said, this was sent on June 14th. $3.51, okay? June 14th. Yeah. But, y'all, oh, hold on, I'll say that in a second. Remind me to talk about screenshots, D. Um, and so, and here's where I showed her I sent it, and she basically, and this is all in this video I'm about to put on here, but it says, um, I said, that is the one you asked, or, and said to send it to. I sent what was left in my cash app to the RC account, and she's saying, nope, I said, girl, <clears throat> She said, nope, she didn't get it. I said, girl, do you have a cash app that you just use? And she said, mine, the Chasble, which is the one she had just said for me to send it to after. Sorry, baby. And um, I said, are you going to be able to get it from the other? And she says, no. I know it's backwards, y'all. I have the hardest time. But again, it's going to be posted in just a second. Um... I did try to send her five because of that, but it did not go through. Um, it says need to be accepted. She said it failed. Try to send it again. It failed. Whatever. So, and then we, oh, hold on. Yeah. So then we're talking about the $30 on July, whatever. And I'm not meaning then like we didn't talk in between. We did talk in between, but not about money. Give me just a second. And I don't know what it went to. I'll just tell you that. Thank you. Um, anyway, I said, uh, basically, I sent you $30. Um, hold on. Okay. I sent you $30. That's why I kept asking over and over. Everybody knows she said she didn't get it, right? Uh, it's not a true... I mean, again... It, it's not relevant. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. It's not relevant. Anyway, um, I said that's why I kept asking over and over in your chat. Um, why haven't you ate? I sent it to you. I sent it to you. I just know, I didn't know if you could see my comments or they were being filtered. She said, what do we do? I'm so pissed. How do I get that back? I know she was a snake. I knew it. I knew it. She's running the main Reddit snark page about me. Uh, she gives me the names. And then she says she made a snark page about me to Discords, a Facebook group, and there's a couple on here. I'm blowing up. This is pissing me off. 
addict. I, yeah, you're right. I am an addict. I'm just in recovery. 100. Yeah, you're right. 100%. I'm, I'm an addict. I've already said that. Um, do you have a point? Ask me. <laughs> I fucking love you. Okay. I didn't mean that. I was replying to someone's comment. Dude. What? I wasn't talking to you. I was talking to the other person if you're talking to me. I'm addicted to soda, right? These motherfuckers are addicted to me. And Lisa, for that damn matter. Maybe I do have an addiction. I'm addicted to Lisa. I'm confused. Where did screenshots come that Reaper posted? I don't know. I mean, I can look, but I don't know. I don't know, we'll go look at it in a, sec in a second. But anyway, so, um, I try to be her friend. She tried to call me, and I was like, I couldn't help, because my dog was literally, do you see him? He's tangled in the vac vacuum cord. Maybe need a job or a hobby. Have a job, have plenty of hobbies. I I'm about to explain that too, Sarah Beth, if you want to stick around for a second. Would you, would you, would you like to stick around? Yeah, um, I, I, again, why would it matter, even if I wasn't, even if I sat my ass in that fucking bed all day, every day, why would it matter to you? I'm not asking you for money, so I, I just don't understand. See, that's the thing, is again, y'all are working off of when I was on home incarceration and was home all day, every day. I know. I have no business talking to about her like everybody else, I guess. Anyway. You're back. Dun -dun 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 -dun. I, I do have an Amazon list. Lots of people do. It's your choice whether to purchase off of it or not. I don't ask. I don't say, oh, these are things we need. No. I don't. Nope. No, I didn't. I didn't talk shit about her using. I said it was sad and it is sad. Again, hold on. People being messy, right? All right. So she said, "It's okay." Question. Um, can you get me that cash app ASAP by chance? This was July twenty sixth. She said, "I was talking to Abby. I got to go on and say anything about Kim." So basically, I'm guessing she's meaning like to get. My, I don't know what she meant by that one. I didn't know at that time. You don't have to. I'm talking about myself and Lisa. My shades are open. See? They're open. I just have blackout curtains in my living room. Because we just got done with summer. Anyway. Um... I said, is the Zelle not working? IDK, what to do, do about Cash App? The only one I have is older, but it has all my info on it <clears throat> where people used to send me money. Um, there is not, and not to mention it is in the hole. This says 36, but I'm almost positive it was 136. I may have mistyped hell, maybe it was 36, but I'm pretty sure it was over 100. Oh, I know. That, just don't worry about it, y'all. As long as they're not completely trash comments, like, just let it be. I'm serious. Um, or if they're doxing anything, obviously. Uh, she said, what, I'm, what am I supposed to do to sign in? I said, hold on, it won't let me add that email. And again, this is on July 27th at 4.05 p.m. Um... I said, do you have an email that hasn't been used on a cash app? Question mark. She said, hold on. I said, okay. She makes a new cash app. Oh, shit. Did I cross? Okay, I did cross that out. Okay. All right. Sorry. So then. Somehow these 
I don't know how that worked. And to me, emo, she sends me the code. Oh, okay, no, they're in order still. Um, I may have accidentally shared that one then. Shit, I don't know. I said that one won't eat, what hurt. <clears throat> that one won't work either. Answer, which I always had to tell her to answer because she never answered phone calls. You think? But she thinks she proved something. I'll let you listen to it in just a second. She thinks she didn't. Anyway, here I'll pull on my laptop as I speak. Okay, and then that is the twenty-seventh. Wow, that one won't work either. Okay, and then um, I said, hey, girly, the next morning, uh, July 28th at 10 a.m., how are you doing this morning? She said, not good, hungry, and no smokes. I said, oh, sorry, I'm just now getting up. Has, any, has no one helped you this morning? She said, nope, been on twice. Um, she said, but with no cash app and no Vidmo, it's killing me. Because, again, she didn't have the cash app yet, and that is July 28th. In the morning. I'm going to ignore the comments for just a second, okay? Oh, much respect for Ashton. Oh, yeah, you're good, baby. I'm about to put it in a video, too, if you want to clip that. Or, hell, I can send it to you. I have, I have your email. You want me to send it to you? I can send you the screenshots individually. I did not mark out her number because when I was doing the green screen, you couldn't see it. It was too far at the top. Okay. All right, I got you. Um, and she said, uh, whoop, where'd I go? Okay. She said, nope, was on twice. No cash app or Vidmo is killing me. I know you would. I was just letting you know, because, like, obviously I use them, but I was just letting you know just in case you didn't pay attention. Um, I said, I have that other one, the Shut Up A8. 99 nine nine as well. She said, is it verified? I can try to log into it with the VPN. And that's when I say, um, oh no, that was, I'm sorry. I said, Vidmo is touchy. The biggest thing with that is if anyone starts requesting a refund, um, it can t be taken down pretty quick. Um, I said, no, it's not verified, but it's older. She said, I don't have a number to use for Vidmo. And she said, okay, can I try logging in? Um, ba -da -ba -ba. Why did that screenshot that more than once? Anyway, she said, oh, okay. Oh, I'm sorry. I said, oh, okay. I've had two of them shut down, talking about Vidmo. Um, she said, I'm going to wait till there's more people, and then I will give the cash up. And again, that was the very first time that she used my cash app. And that was July 28th at... Sorry, my fucking camera got lower. Oh. I'm sorry. Okay, that was at 10.14 p.m. I mean a.m., sorry. Let me still... Oh, okay, yeah, y'all are good. I'll send it out. Um... I said, okay, oh, I said that about the Bidmo already. Um, the moment I called that one lady a, see you next Tuesday, she said, yep, you are just like Lisa. At least you don't try to cover up her sugarcoat shit. That's me talking to Lisa. And then Lisa says, yeah, we are what they see. They could never take the heat that we take. And I said, it truly makes me wonder how they even made it through addiction. I'm willing to bet they were ad addicted to one bin o, and they're calling it addiction. They've never been on any hard stuff, is what I said. Um, okay, sorry, these did get backwards because this is, um, I'm talking about going to get my ID. Hold on. Okay, there we go. I'm sorry. Uh, she said, uh, yeah, I can't make a new one. I said, okay, I took my medicine. 
um, let me put some shoes on and I'll walk down my driveway to get it, talking about my ID. Um, you better know that I care about you. I'm about to walk down my long ass driveway just to get my ID to see if I can verify this. Uh, my ankle braces is going to start yelling at me. She's out of the circle. She's out of the circle. <laughs> um, which, yeah. Anyway, she said, thank you so much. I ain't got shit to go on with and I'm starving. Um, I said, okay. Uh, or she said, okay. I said, Gracie hats with a black rose. She said, getting ready. What does that mean? I said, what does what mean? The name of the account is Gracie hats and has a picture of a black rose. If that's what you were talking about. She said, okay, ready. And then that was at... July 28th at 11 a.m. See? I don't know if y'all can see that. See? July 28th. Um, oh, and I also... Where did I go? Damn it. Oh. Oh, that was the other screen. Anyway, I just show where it jumped from June to... I like that. I'm sorry. Yeah, these are... I'm about to post a video, guys. Um, sorry, I went back to see what I was doing. Okay. So, she was talking... I'm trying to have more screenshots than that. Oh, we're talking about CSS. And she said, like, what is being said, though? And look at the date... Do you see that date? August 5th. This is the day the cash app went down. Um, I said, but unfortunately, I will do whatever it takes to prove that I was not keeping any of your money whatsoever. She said, you don't need to. I said, give her info to use on you linking me to you and the cash app. I'm talking about Kim R. Because Kim R was saying that she was going to give that to Villain. And if we all remember, it's awful strange. Really strange to me at least. Um, hold on. Let me pull this up really quick. Where would that clip be? Is it right here? No. When Kim was around, Kim H. No, that's on it either. Damn it. Where is that fucking phone call? Hold on. Okay, here we go. Okay, so everybody probably remembers that um, when Villain got the screenshot that had the Gracie hats, but it had my name on it, I said I thought that was edited. I did not say I thought that was edited because that cash app wasn't mine. I said my name was not on that cash app with that tag. So I was pretty sure that it was edited. I still think it was edited. I don't know for sure, but I think so. But listen, this is what Kim Orr is stating that she has done several times which is probably also how they got the thirty dollars that was declined but i wasn't willing to give her money she would ask me to photoshop oh hold on i'm sorry i didn't go back far enough here you go really quickly like about this screenshots <coughs> anytime that she didn't have money and i wasn't willing to give her money she would ask me to photoshop a fake cash up or diesel um anywhere between 40 to 60 dollars and yeah, I would do it. Um, now, what she would do is, this is when Kim was around, Kim H, and me and Kim H have never, ever talked, ever. And so she would be like, I need you to make me the screenshot, blah, 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 if she couldn't get money out of me. So I would do the screenshot, send it to Diesel, and it would have to be between a certain time, because it would be like either 3 to 6 in the morning, because it would be sent to someone else's cash app. And okay, and that's what y'all have heard the other day when I played it, right? They're talking about how they basically would manipulate Kim H into sending more money by saying Raya stole it, Raya told him that it was sent, and it wasn't, that kind of stuff, right? So, isn't it very, very ironic that the same person that is stating she did this to deceive other people is also the same person that sent somebody else the screenshot 
that I said was edited. Is that weird? Because surely she wouldn't have just photoshopped that screenshot too, right? Okay, I digress. <coughs> Mm. Exactly. It does. It does. Because obviously, I mean, I have an email, actually. I just thought about that. I have an email that LR sent me of text conversations between her and Raya trying to convince me that Raya actually, actually did lie to her. And I went back and forth for a second because like I was like, is she just lying? Are they lying together? Like, whatever. But then with those emails, I was like, no, Raya really did take it. Just to find out all this shit, but whatever. Um, so, as I said, I showed y'all the beginning and I showed you the end, right? So, um, again, I'm talking about Raya giving out the information stating that that was my cash app, correct? And that, as you've seen, is August 5th. Again, if we go back to when she says the, ask me about that cash app, which is a shut up cash app. <gasps> I'm sorry, y'all, my head is, my ears just started ringing really bad. Sorry. Whew, that was not a lot. Mm. Sorry, I'm having to go through these really quick. Okay. So, as you see, shut up 8899, which is the one in question, my cash app, that I gave or let her use to receive money. Um, July 28th at 11 a.m. That is the very first time that she used the Shut Up Cash App. If you don't believe me, prove me wrong. Show me. All her videos are on YouTube. I know you went and looked. I know you did. Show me where the Shut Up Cash App was used before July, what I say? July 28th. Again, first day to the day that Raya is leaking my information, which is the day I cut it off, August 5th. So, for the visual learners, how long is that? Less time than it even said it was. I did not help her with a cash app since May. And as a matter of fact, if everybody remembers, I was locked up for 10 days at the end of May. How in the fuck was I helping with anything? I, was I was I sitting in the corner checking the cash app for her? No. Anyway. Because I was stupid. I was stupid. Again, I wanted to see if I could gain her trust. Yeah. If y'all have questions, I'll, I'll read them. Because I felt, I, I felt bad for her. And again, it wasn't a smart decision, but I did. But as I stated multiple times, I helped her with a cash app. Yes, I sent her money before that. Of which every single bit of it, according to her, was stolen. Even $3. Anyway, um, I did not help her with a cash app until... Um, July 28th, actually. I've been saying the 26th, I think. No. I didn't send anything in May. The first one that I sent, like I said, was $3 and some change. Hold on. Um, and that was June 14th. And again, $3.51. The time... Or the date is at the bottom. I know it says today, so the date's at the bottom. It wasn't stolen. I know it wasn't. Now I know that. I know. I know that because misinformation is being spread. Just like it was also spread that I had a protection order that I don't have. I don't have a protection order, nor have I ever even tried to get one from her.
No, I didn't feel sorry for her because she couldn't get that. Um, I felt sorry for her because I'd been in that situation. And again, I would not fucking be standing here on my own two feet had some of these women, women also helped me. Good God. Had some of these women not helped me when they knew dang, dang good and well that... I was most likely not doing the best of things. I did, yeah, I said that. I wanted to gain her trust. Did you do it? I mean, maybe, like, a deep inside, but I, I mean, quite frankly, I, I don't know. I, I told y'all, if there was a man laying on the sidewalk with a tourniquet still wrapped around his head, or head, hand, arm, whatever, I would still buy him a cheeseburger. Now, I've done told y'all, I'm like, I am, I'm sorry for what I did, I should not have helped her. But at the end of the day, agree with me or disagree, if I didn't do it, she would have found somebody that would have, right? Because clearly, I only did it for a week and she's been doing this for way longer than a week. Yeah. And, you know, I've seen this and please don't get me wrong, I'm so happy that Raya did it too. But I also told y'all I sent her information for rehab. I sent her information um, for homeless shelters. I sent her information to get help with electricity and water and fucking even rent. At the end of the day, again, I wanted to gain her trust to do whatever I thought I could do as a little baby addict in recovery. Like to gain her trust hoping that I said it so many times you are you can be steps behind me again Mimi again I've done said yes I was aware that she was most likely using but um, not all of that money, in my opinion, would have been for that. Like, we do know she smokes. We do know that, you know, although they, addicts may not eat much, they still fucking eat. Um, I, I don't know. Like, in, do y'all understand that, and this is the reason I made the statements on the family like at the beginning of all of this. But do y'all not understand that, yes, A, I was Lisa once upon a time. Um, some people still try to act like I am. But, do you know how many, I knew that there quite possibly was a ton. I know, I know that's crazy. Hindsight's 2020, baby. Um, but I also know as being somebody that has been in the same fucking predicament, there is a lot of shit that has been said about me, especially in addiction, that was not true. Not even in the fucking slightest. Just like people are making up shit now. So, to me, it was a little different than me just sitting here. It was a little different than me just sitting here going oh no you know what the hell did I just do okay I got it um you know all these things that are being said are true although I didn't know what was true and what wasn't true like I knew shit was made up about me so I knew everything that was going around about her was not probably all true although I didn't know about the I know, I, I, Rachel, I, I know that. I know that now, and again, 
hindsight, like, I know that. Um, but yeah. I know. I know. Okay. Then if what I did can get me in trouble, let it get me in trouble. Um, again, as many people have told y'all during my addiction, um, and obviously people have said about her too, at the end of the day, the money that was sent was sent for particular items, correct? Never, not once, did she message me, talk to me, anything stating, oh, I'm going to go use this money for that. Never. So at the end of the day, anybody giving her money with the means of please go buy food, it's out of your hands at that point. You gave her the money. It, you may wholeheartedly think she needs food, but at the end of the day, we don't know. There is no, like, list of everything that she purchased with every dollar, just like with me. How many people, uh, my girls that have been around for a long time, how many of y'all said to plenty of haters, it doesn't matter what she did with the money after it left my hand, after it left my cash app, it was hers. That's on her what she did with it afterwards. I sent it for this. And that's, that's what I'm saying. Like, that's, that's all I'm saying. At the end of the day, like, and I even have text proof. Yeah, exactly. I even have text proof that she was telling us, and I can say us because, again, most of the time I was on the three-way call, just, like, really weird, like, there were... I don't know, when Rhea released the messages, like, there was two of them, and then with me, it was like we needed a, we needed a, a emotional support person to get through the Lisa shit. <laughs> oh. Yeah. How much did she get? Um, I've showed that. She sent 500 and something. Well, I'm sorry. Rephrase, Victoria. On that particular cash app, which again, don't, or you should remember that, you know, there was Vidmo, Chime, PayPal, whatever else, right? But at that particular time, that what was sent out of that account was 560 something dollars in a week. In just a week. Yes, ma'am. <sighs> it, yeah, obviously it's not for me. Again, Rachel, I, yes, I know. Did y'all, did you not hear Raya, y'all? Like, she was like, something about, shit, where'd my phone go? I don't even remember the amount, but she said something that was crazy. Amount of something, hold on. Right after the live, and I wouldn't. Y'all don't need to hear that. I'm sorry. <laughs> Due to her, and he's like, "What are you talking about?" And I said, "Where is Lisa?" And I said, know the amount? I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. I, I found it. She's one of those people that just misplaced it. Oh no, what is Jericho saying? So, so we, so I found it. Oh, maybe that's She's a different Jericho. Oh, I'm so sorry. I apologize. Victoria um, Jacqueline. You know, 
Exactly. It's donations, so I don't know. And most of which, like the the scent thing, it says for Lisa. So I don't know. Possibly. Actually, if it was a donation, it's tax right off, right? <laughs> yeah. You're good. I don't know. There's so many more calls. I just... Oh, hold on. Hello, my lady. Hello, I don't know. But anyway, Raya says at some point, like, the astronomical amount of money that she had sent her recently. I don't know where that one is. Yeah, Is that on here? Oh, it's not in there. I don't know. Okay, babe. You're good. I don't know where it's at. I would have to look for it. But, like, Raya was like, no. I, I've literally sent her this huge amount of money in the last week or something. <sighs> I, you tell me then we'll both know, girlfriend. I know. I know. Right? That's what I said. I mean, she states multiple times that her husband or her boyfriend, husband, whatever, is a business owner, um, which we know most of the business accounts um, was from Raya. So I don't, I have no earthly idea. I don't know. Hmm. <laughs> You're good. Oh, here we go. I'm just going to put this on here and I'm going to play it in the background so we can, I can see if I can find it. But, yeah. like, when I left the building, you know, when I um, cut out on August 7th, like, I was no longer going to help with absolutely anything. And I haven't, um, except for, like I said, sending her homeless shelters and shit. Um Right here. For some reason, I thought it was like right before. I don't know. But yeah. Yes, I do. I do. She has removed herself completely from TikTok, um, as far as I'm aware. Uh, <laughs> I mean, but I've been lied to before. <laughs> And everybody keeps saying, like, I had nothing. I had nothing to do with um, her in Kim H at all. I had nothing to do with it. I had nothing to do with it being reported. I had nothing to fucking do with it. I was under the assumption when I went off, basically, on her sitting in a courtroom because... Lisa was asking for $45 for an Uber ride that I looked up and it was 11 um, and she, I was, you know, don't, don't do it, girl, like, don't do it, and anyway, she did it anyway, and then Lisa lied and said that she missed the, missed the ride or something like that, and so she had to buy enough one. It's insane. It really is. But again, at the end of the day, here I'm gonna go ahead and post this video. Um, at the end of the day, there's just, I can't take back what I did. I can't. And um, I can only just be sorry for it. 
Oh, and I found it kind of crazy earlier. I wish. I don't think anybody records that person's lives, so. Um, I wish I could get it, though, because a certain um, addict uh, advocate, which was formerly an addict herself, um, she said something along the lines of um, there is... Shit. There is steps to recovery and making amends that there was no way in hell she would be able to repay some of the people that had helped her but she did apologize and then uh for lying to her friends and then um you know after that when she got into a really good space she then gave back which i i've tried to do as well but I just don't understand why that's okay. We cannot talk about my kids, guy. Or dude. I, we can't. Um, Y'all have no earthly idea what is going on and what isn't going on. And we're just going to leave it with that. Did you, you, Gallon? to do deep dive on you. What? Oh, villain. Don't care. I don't, I don't know what it was ever said. I don't remember. I done told you. Like, I have memory issues. I've had them for a while. I'm clinically diagnosed. Um, so, even with the fact that addiction fucks up your memory. Like, imagine that times 20 because I also have an issue. So, I could never, could absolutely never pay back everything. A. And B. Y'all. And I've said this too, and in case somebody missed it, okay? I truly, as much as I can remember, um, made, uh, shit. Hold on, I'm sorry. Oh, I truly could never remember all of the shit that I possibly owe back. Um, like, there's just no way in hell. I, I would never be able to live any type of life trying to pay those people back. And it was really fucking awesome. The other day, somebody came to me and said, oh, and that's what I was going to say. I'm sorry. Um, I just remembered some are, yeah, and a lot of people that helped me were on that cash app that got shut down, so I can't even see it anymore, um, but, uh, shit, oh, somebody, thank you so much, somebody the other day that has been here for a long time, they messaged me, and they said, I promise you, I would never ask back, oh, that's the other thing, sorry y'all, I'm all over the place right now, she said I would never ask back for what I did send you, because it was donations, the best way that you are paying me back is living a sober life, um, and uh, I get to see that, I get to see my donations eventually paid off, and you're here, um, I also said at the beginning of all of this that I would have much rather have sent her money than to know that she was out there doing some pretty horrific things to get said money. And I wasn't harming myself financially by sending her anything. So like that's just that's just the way I look at it. I don't I don't know. Ask me in 10 years, maybe I'll have a different perspective. But right now, that, that's just how, I, how it plays in my head. <sighs> that's, 
that's the thing though a lot of people are trying to act like a that I'm supposed to just pay back every penny that was ever given to me um, although I realize like loans is a whole different ball game than uh, um, donations but um, I, but like my question again who are they to hold me accountable who are they to be able to judge what I have and have not done? I literally can prove all fucking day on this app that I am clean. I have not failed not one test. Not one fucking test since I've been on medication to help. I am tapering down. I am on 10 milligrams. Less than a year out of a pretty bad addiction, I am on 10 milligrams. 10 that, that's unheard of. I, I don't have any relapse in sight. Um, as far as I can tell. Although I know you can go from this to this in 2.5 seconds. But, yeah. I Thank you. But harming her. Like, just work on you. I know, baby. I, I know. I just... Anyway. I don't understand why... I've tried. I've tried talking to villain. I have. I've tried talking to her. I've messaged her way more than once. Um, the only thing she wants to do is talk in public. And that says a lot to me. It's not about letting people know what I've done. If you cannot talk to someone. Hey, we both know we both going to fucking record that shit. But I don't know. It just says a lot. It says a lot to me. Yeah, that I just, am I wrong? Like, seriously, tell me I'm wrong if I'm wrong. Whatever. If we decided after an adult conversation that we also were going to go out, that would be different. But the fact that this person I have messaged three times on one account because that's the max before, like, if they don't accept it, like, whatever, right? Um... And I messaged her on a different account, too. And I have got zip, zilch back. Um, you know, it it's just crazy to me, dude. It doesn't need to be public. It, do, it doesn't have to be. I'm not... I, that would be an opinion. That, that would be an opinion. That whether or not...